How y'all doing? 17 HMR Taurus. I guess they call it the Taurus Model Third uh, M17. Now, I was doing a video earlier. This thing fell over. So, I still want to try this at 30 yards. I'm going to zoom you in. The whole stand fell over from the wind. Going back at 30. I'm going to take as many shots as I can. I got seven. See how many times I hit at 30 yards. Then I'm going to reload. And we're going to go over there and shoot those water jugs. And we'll see what uh, this thing, see if this thing's viable or just a gimmick. All right. If I hit it at 30, I might go up to 40. Let's see what happens. I guess 30 yards is kind of doable. I do see one of my hits. They were, it was low on the other one. I'll have to watch the video. All right, I'm reloading here. There's a little golf ball on top of that milk jug. I'm gonna try to hit that first. Then I'm gonna make sure I save a bullet for the jugs of water. And I'm looking down these cylinders and I see a whole bunch of unburnt powder. So, eh, what can you do? It's about 22 yards here. I'm gonna try to hit that golf ball. Here we go. Wind's blowing a little, but this gun's pretty heavy. This yardage, this thing is pretty viable, I guess. I'm not sure if I hit it or I just grazed it, so it ain't my eyes. All right, let's zoom you back down. This is me trying to shoot it in at 10 yards, and then I'm realizing it's not shooting that bad. So maybe the more you shoot this thing, the better it gets. But. Here we go, pretty close up. Four jugs of water. In a rifle at 100 yards, it goes through the, goes into the first one, blows it up, and nothing happens to the, the back one, in theory. Sometimes it blows it up a little bit. Let's see, I guess I'm gonna be about five yards away. Here we go. Maybe four yards. Uh, line up. Ah. Okay. I got some water all the way back here. That is a six inch barrel, so it should gain some velocity. Ah. Let me clean all my glasses before we walk up there. say most of the projectile blew up in the first jug.
got copper jack. See these 17 grain bullets don't have much lead in it. So you see all the copper everywhere? Something came out the back and went into the other jug. Let's see what it is. Another piece of copper. <laughs> All right. I feel froggy. I'm going to back up there to about 20, 25 yards if I can and see what happens. I'm going to leave this go. The top's off. Let's see what happens. Let's see if I can hit it. Maybe this thing is coming into its own. I don't know. I ate my lunch before, or a crow, they call it. This is about 20, 22 yards. I'm on my knees. some more ammo in here. We're going to go up to about I know it's a long video. We're going to go up to about 40 yards and see if I can hit it. Let's see what happens. You guys still on there? Yep, long videos. Almost seven minutes. Hang on a second. I guess I'm going to have to eat some crow here. Wow. What happened? Everything blew up. Did exactly what it's supposed to. God. I have a uh, I have been wrong before, and uh, I am definitely wrong on this one. That was 40 yards. This video is too long. I really should go to all the way to 50. I don't know what happened. Maybe, uh, maybe this gun just came into its own. Maybe it's clicking in the right spot. I don't know what's going on. But, uh, yeah, I guess maybe there is something for this 17 HMR. I got three more shots, but this video is way too long. <sighs> Apparently, I got to make an apology video or something. I'm not sure what to say, but, uh, what the fuck happened? Excuse my language, but what the fuck happened? How'd this thing go from shooting like shit yesterday and Sunday today almost can't miss all right god bless bye